What's up friends? Welcome back to a new video on TRD. Today we are going to talk about the WAX blockchain project, Our Planet. So, uh, Our Planet is an upcoming game on the WAX blockchain. It is going to be launching on the 16th of February, so in a couple of days. And it is pretty unique in what it does. Um, so, basically, what you are going to do in this uh, game, you are going to stake NFTs from different WAX blockchain games, not only for, from our planet. And by staking those other NFTs, for, uh, for example, from the game Alien Worlds, you are going to get Ether, which is a, a token on the WAX blockchain and it's the in-game currency of the R Planet game, of the R Planet universe. And with Ether you can create basic elements. Those will be um, yeah, elements in the game, they won't be NFTs on WAX actually. And you can combine those elements. And if you create a new element that nobody else has created until this time, then you get an NFT card which is uh, based on the WAX blockchain and you get a reward in WAX tokens. And that's pretty much it. So they have this roadmap here. As you can see the part 1, the evacuation, is basically uh, built around this uh, element thing and then you will have later in part 2 you will have colonization, you will have land, you will be able to construct different buildings uh, new elements Then later you will have part 3 conquest where you will have robots you have will characters and I guess this will also have some kind of PvP content um, Yeah, so I linked this website into the description and you can uh, read uh, those uh, texts here yourself um, there is not too much information actually on the game itself, on how it will exactly work, etc. Um, but that's not the point of this video. What I wanted to show you in this video is how you can put your idle NFTs from games that you play uh, to work for you to earn um, either tokens for the r -Plant game. So for that you go on rplanet.io slash staking, I'll put a li link to this into the description. And you will get to this page. As you can see here, there are a couple of uh, bl WAX blockchain games listed on here. Uh, Our Planet itself, Tribal Books, uh, Garbage Pale Kit. Um, I think those are not necessarily NFTs actually, uh, not necessarily games actually, but generally NFTs. Um, you have Blockchain Heroes, you have Cox, Alien Worlds, Colabog, you have Uplift Art, The Horrors, Dark Country, and you have Ken Bozak. So, and if you have any um, NFTs in those games, and if you don't use them, you can just take them. So, for that, you go on this more info here in uh, the game that you want to take your NFTs from. And you are will be redirected to this uh, page special uh, for this game. And as you can see here, different NFTs have uh, a different number of this other uh, here. And this 0 0.6 is how much other you get per hour for staking this NFT. So for example, I have um, I think 10 cards staked here and each of them gives me uh, 0.6 NFT, uh, 0.6 Ether per hour, per hour. So um, I get six per hour. And if you want to stake one um, more NFT, you just uh, click the stake button here, and it will open the transaction that you just signed. So I uh, auto signed it now, but you have to manually manually do it, of course, if you are um, doing this for the first time. And yeah, so then the NFT will appear here and you can unstake it at any time if you want. So I could just click unstake here. Um, I would sign the transaction. And 
as you can see here we get the NFT back instantly so I stake it again because I want it to be staked and yeah once you have done this then you can claim your collected rewards here so every time uh, this amount of rewards is added to your total pool which you can claim here um, I don't actually know if there is a limit of how much ether is saved um, in this claiming pool before it doesn't add more um, but as you could have seen right now at least 10 hours worth of ether can be saved and yeah you can actually also trade ether for that let's head over to the Alcra exchange and just search for it so the current price is very low 0.00052 um, wax per Either. So, uh, I think it could be worth buying some of them um, just so if the game will be successful that uh, you could probably sell them for a higher price or maybe even use for the game because right now we have no information about uh, the actual in-game value of either. Uh, we don't know how much you will need or any other information so um, they uh, also have a medium block um, I linked that into the description also they have a couple of articles um, about the game so here uh, they had an asset sale a couple of days ago where they sold packs which contained basic um, elements for the game and all of them sold out so we can actually click here we can you can see they sold one pack for 100 wax and they had a total of 2.4k packs and they all sold out. I don't know how quickly this happened but uh, yeah they don't sell more packs right now. And yeah so as I said you can uh, find more uh, inform uh, information about the game on their medium page, on their uh, game page here. and. Yeah, so staking them is really easy, so if you have, I don't know, for example, Alien Walls NFTs that you don't use, I don't know a reason why you shouldn't stake them. I mean, of course, if you don't want to sell them, um, whether selling the NFTs or staking them, I don't know what's uh, better from that. But probably at the current prices of Ether at least, I think you can get more uh, Ether by just selling the NFTs and um, yeah, buying Ether with them. But who knows how um, staking NFTs in the future might work, maybe it will be worth much more, so it's of course a, a decision that you have to take. Um, but yeah, that's it for today's video, so I showed you how you can easily stake those NFTs, um, your idle NFTs that you don't use, I um, showed how you can trade the Ether that you get, and the actual game will launch on uh, February the 16th, 16th, so I'll probably do a video on the actual game once it's launched, but I uh, won't uh, give you a guarantee on that. Anyways, so I hope you have enjoyed this video. I hope I could have helped you. If you have any questions or suggestions, just write a comment. I'll read all of them. I'll try to reply as fast as possible. Have a great day. See you in the next video. Bye.